ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a brand new episode of the Burping Contest. We, are, for the first time since this series started, are in a completely different state of oh, mind snap. and existence. <laughs> new York State to be exact. We are here with my brother Seth. And we are also here at Stewart's Gas Station, which is a New York staple. And we are about to go in here and we are about to pick our Burpa-Cola for today's burping contest. So let's go see what we can find. Okay, so we're looking at our options right now. As you can see, they got their own line of soda here, Stewart's Shops. I'm gonna get, for sure, the Diet Ginger Ale, and then I'm gonna go ahead and grab something else, which I'm not quite sure what it is yet. What about you, Seth? I see root beer. Oh, it's all gone. Oh, you're right. Do ginger ale for sure. So we got our final choices. I got uh, Stewart Shops, Stewart's Shops, Diet Cola, Shops. and Diet Ginger Ale. So I got the citrus and I got the cola. The cola. cola. And Seth got regular ginger ale and then a two liter of root beer because they didn't have any of the small root beers. We both got citrus and we both got the cola. The, the cola. And we'll see what the results are. Now we do have some backups at the Airbnb that we're staying at. So if for some reason these just aren't knocking it out of the park, We'll pull out some other options and see what kind of results we can come up with, throw up with. It is time, ladies and gentlemen, for another burping contest. And it's a burping contest that you have all been waiting for is a Seth. Brother Seth, Mr. Man from New York State. We are going to cover a few different topics today while we're working up some burps. So one thing about Seth is ever since we were little kids, we've loved action figures. And not just any regular action figures, wrestling action figures. So what we're gonna do today is Seth has some packages that he has recently ordered and we're gonna open them up and talk about our love for action figures because I kind of went through a phase after I got to an age where I wasn't really playing with toys anymore. Seth never really got out of that. And then just in the, like the past year-ish, I've kind of gotten back into action figures as well. Now we share in our love for action figures in a lot of ways, action figures that we could never have as kids. Ones we asked for for Christmas and our parents never got us for Christmas. So we have to get them now as adults and pay for them ourselves. So thanks mom and dad, love you guys. As well as just like some of the current uh, like special collectible action figures and things like that. As well as talking about this little beauty right here, which is our Vinny Space Film Festival Award mm -hmm. for our documentary Squatch Iowa. And I will put the link up in the corner of the video to make sure that you guys uh, know where you can go to check out all of our Squatch content. We have our own YouTube channel called CCPI TV. It covers a wide array of paranormal things and individual projects, like my Search for Sasquatch video was up on there. Seth has some uh, individual documentaries up on there as well. We are uploading our own individual content as well as stuff that we've done together. We have a full documentary called Haunted Iowa on there, which is 243,000 views. 243,000 views, so I'll link that as well. And we also have uh, the first 50 minutes of our Squatch Iowa documentary is live on our YouTube channel. So you can check out the first 50 minutes of Squatch Iowa completely for free. And then on there, after the video is done, you can find the links to go rent or purchase uh, the Squatch Iowa documentary to finish out the remaining minutes that uh, exist beyond the 50 minute preview. Like we said, we have uh, some citrus cola. The bulk ginger ale, I got diet ginger ale, also has regular ginger ale. So we're gonna go ahead and start with our citrus and uh, you can hear noise off in the background. And those tiny noises that you're hearing, those are my tiny wife, <laughs> who decided to come down in the midst of us taping this. And she doesn't even like burps. She's getting ice cream right now because that was the priority, was to come down and get ice cream. Tiny, you're gonna have to come in and at least show your face. This is the one and only time you'll probably ever see Tiny <laughs> on a burping contest video. Hi, but it's only for the ice cream. Just it's for the ice cream. ice cream from Stewart's shops. <laughs> mm. All right, get your ice cream. Get out of here. I'm out. <laughs> so let's go ahead and crack these bad boys open. Again, starting with the ginger ale and the diet ginger ale. So let us enjoy. It's nice and bubbly. Cheers, Sam. Cheers, boss. Mmm, that's good. Mm. Cheyenne's really gonna hurt if I get that ice cream now. It's not bad. 
Not That's bad. good, yeah. It's distributed by Stewart Shops Corporation from Saratoga Springs, right here in New York State. It's only like 40 minutes from here. All right, well, what topic first? Ooh. Ooh. Juicy. Well, we we'll threw up. Um, I think we'll start off talking about I think the most important part of your life right now. Oh, yeah. You just had a kid. <coughs> I did just have a kid. You just had a kid. The first extension of the only bloodline since I was born in '87. Seth, tell us what is it like to be a dad? It's uh, it's pretty awesome. A little interesting. Learning a lot. It's kind of like a whirlwind right now. But it's fun. It's like almost taking care of a new puppy. <laughs> making sure he's doing good, making sure he's fed. Um, um, except you gotta change his diapers, you don't get to just let him out into the yard. I mean, you um, could, but... You're kind of like always on edge, making sure he's okay. It's like you got the, like, the most fragile collectible on the planet, and you're just like making sure... Like I just wake up at night and I'm like, is he breathing? Is he good? But it's awesome. I love the kid. He's really content. Super he quiet. Even with He's a awesome. diaper diaper full of dump, just chills. Doesn't cry about it, just continues sleeping. <clears throat> so fun, so, so good being a dad. <clears throat> Getting destroyed. <clears throat> <clears throat> Oof, I've tasted my lunch twice already. <laughs> Simmer. I know. But yeah, we'll have to introduce you to the man. His name is Manly Robert. <coughs> I just about foamed through my oh, nose. Shoot. <laughs> I'm just over here like having a deep Ooh. conversation. Jesse's about dragging it right out the nose. Oh man. Oh, I feel one cooking. Wait, I guess I did show it on my, my uh, film festival vlog. But just take a look at this beauty. Credit goes to Elizabeth Saint for the wonderful design. And we just want to thank you again for honoring us with this beautiful UFO Abducting Film Reels Award. Again, it is the official Squatch Iowa Best Cup feature, Cryptid UFO Paranormal feature of the Video Space Film Festival. <laughs> 2020, the very first cup award that was ever given out on behalf of the Video Space Film Festival belongs to us. We got it. Let's just jump right into action figures because okay. that's something we both enjoy, we both love. I think you're pretty excited to yeah to see. I've been even I've been waiting on a couple of these for a couple of weeks, and so I'm excited to get them. He doesn't know what's in them. I don't. I have no idea what they are. <laughs> and I usually have to show them off via phone. Yep. So this actually will be a complete straight throwback to our childhood when we were kids. Our favorite. We had all of the the classics like the Hasbro's and some of the <laughs> WWE. <laughs> My gosh, that read. Right? That's <laughs> lunch. Straight up beef. That is lunch. Um, but our favorite line was the WCW Toy Biz Toys. Mm -hmm. It's new WCW Slash The WCW's most famous wrestlers performing their most famous moves. Stinger Splash! Lex Luger lays the torture rack on Sting. I bet that stings. <laughs> Here comes Kevin Nash to power bomb the giant. Bob's away. Macho Man gives DDP a seat. Goldberg's got Nash up and Jackhammer! It's a smashing, slamming free for all. New WCW Smash and Slam wrestlers. Ring and figures each sold separately. Oh! The Malenko! I, I, as in my in my older years, being our favorite toy line, I wanted to collect like as many of them as possible. Yeah. I've been collecting the ones from the 90s. This is Dean Malenko. Oh. The man of a thousand holes. Uh, known as a man of a thousand holes. Dean Malenko, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Whoa. Whoops. Oh yeah, I remember you telling me you got these. That's right. Yep. So I bit on this Ric Flair. And Ric Flair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like bid a buck fifty for this guy, and I won the the eBay bid at a buck fifty. And then the dude emails me, he's like, "I'll throw in Dean for two dollars." And I was like, "Yes." Ric Flair, who looks like Charles Robinson, who is known as Little Nate, <laughs> the referee underneath uh, Ric Flair's control. They do have the Four Horsemen logo. And Dean Malenko has on in his trunks as well because they were part of the faction this was a, yeah, Four Horsemen. This was a, from a pack, Four Horsemen yeah. pack. A 
along with uh, Chris Benoit and uh, Mongo yeah, McMichael. Listen up, people! Look how tan Ric Flair is. <laughs> He's literally orange. <laughs> Looks like Donald Trump. Very good, very good, very good. That one's polished. <coughs> <coughs> It's not doing too bad. This diet ginger ale is doing pretty good. Yeah, I'm actually <coughs> impressed. Good thing you got the two liter because you're cooking through this stuff. I know, like chugging it, trying to hope that my birds aren't turning as well. So these two are from eBay. Yep. And this is from Walmart. These, the rest are from Walmart. Oof. So this one Oof. is lay it the smack it down. Back rock, which I loved. I think this is like the sickest rock figure until that ultimate drops. <coughs> trying to watch here. <coughs> <laughs> oh yeah, sorry I'm blocking that. Wow, his face looks so good. Ooh, nice. <laughs> By the way, ladies and gentlemen, I think I've mentioned it a few times on the channel, but Seth has his own YouTube channel as well. Yes. That I want you to subscribe to. So just we're gonna take a pause. I want you to stop what you're doing. And you're gonna click right up here and you're gonna subscribe to Ready Seth Go. He has a wide array of different things that he's gonna be covering on his YouTube channel. Um, Ready? From, um, go! Cut, 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 cut. <laughs> Woo! That was a good one. <laughs> There's an upcoming true crime style uh, vlog. Just kind of some cool stuff, some sights, Ur Ur sightseeing around New York. Urbex. Some Urbex, yep. Make sure you click right up here. Ready Seth Go. Hit that subscribe button. And make sure that you uh, hit that notification bell so you get notified every time yes, he has a new video. Yes, thank you very much. Ready, go! <laughs> oh, oh my gosh! My gosh. Oh. I felt that just bubbling. The set kind of panicked. He almost tried to spit it all back in the bottle, but there was still too much foam. He couldn't do it. Wow, there's root beer all over the floor. Is there? All over the floor. That is a burping contest first. Dude, that was bad. <laughs> <laughs> You cannot chug a fresh bottle of rubber, that is correct. And now for something completely different. <laughs> You'll get a little waterlogged at the at the end of this video. She's Louise, man. I can't cover the entire air hole. That's what she said. <laughs> Foamy root beer. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh. 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 Collecting, especially since our childhood. But. So. <laughs> yeah, that was gross. I felt like noodles were going through my throat. So what is it about action figures? I know we love toys, right? But it seems like it was something that you never got out of, and why? I don't know. I, I like when I was Star Wars started coming out with the new Star Wars, like Episode One and stuff. I just like. Thought it'd be fun to collect all the figures. I kept them in the package and I thought this would be cool to have them on display because people <laughs> did that. It was a good way to, like, I never fell out of love with toys. I just love how they look. I love how, you know, I always have a huge imagination. And then that slightly started dying off. I became a toy photographer and it just like shot through the roof. Like, Which, by the way, follow him on Instagram at that only guy. Make sure you follow him on Instagram for really cool photos, toy photography and things like that. That's uh, definitely a huge passion and that's what drove me to start collecting again. And then my wrestling figure collecting has always been like, other, other than Ninja Turtles, has always been like my highest collecting. <laughs> oh man. Don't force it. Don't force it. <laughs> 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 Yes, indeed. <laughs> Dude, 
they might not be as numerous, but I make them to count when they come out. I was like Dave. Yeah. <laughs> They weren't constant and consistent, but when you let them go, they, they were good. <laughs> Goodness, shook the walls. <laughs> <laughs> this one's harder to chug. It's like a full pot. Oh, like the it? citrus was easy, was easy to get down. Yeah, it's like woof. So I was I was very impressed though with the, the diet ginger ale. You're driving through New York, obviously probably not right now because of the coronavirus. <laughs> Ooh, that was chunky. Yes, it was. Reminded me of goulash. That is a good point. We are actually, as the world sees it, the apocalypse zone of New York while they have like... <laughs> Over 100,000 cases in New York alone. Is that where it's at now? Yep. <laughs> We are perfectly fine. Literally, we are in Podunk, New York State. Yes, queen. Yes. You smell those hot dogs it's like in the a, head It's like a sweet, sick, gross, sour smell. <laughs> Goodness. That was wonderful. Goodness gracious. <laughs> That was like an old Ford truck. It was. <laughs> oh, you should have manly join this. That blew me through the wall the other day. Farts like a champ too. Oh boy. My goodness. Sprays like a champ too. <laughs> a future contestant on burping contest. Manly Robert only. Hey, why do we... Also known as Man Bob. Man Bob. Hi, bud. The newest addition of the all me family. Say hello to YouTubes. Say hello to the <laughs> YouTubes. On behalf of you, Manly Robert, I dedicate this next burp to you, <laughs> sir. <laughs> What was that? Ooh, his eyes got real big. <laughs> <laughs> Look at how little he is. He's so tiny. About the only tiny thing in this video. Your burps are big. Two. Ooh. Ooh. You start slipping. Look at little manly Robert. Hi, everybody. Hello. 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 My dad's working up some burps right Damn. now. Ooh. See my cute face. Let's see if we can get one more burp out. And on that note, on behalf of little manly Robert on me, on behalf of my brother Seth, on behalf of me, it's on me. Remember. <laughs> His face. He was mesmerized. It is all me. Oh man, I'm, they're all gonna come out after this is over. I know. <laughs> but, oh. And we will see you <laughs> in the next one. He's so mesmerized. Say goodbye. 
It's all me and no foot. <laughs> Goodbye. I'm gonna go throw a. Uh...